got a lot of Scottish country dancing and enjoyed the music. And then I saw the advertisement for, by James Frenchick for Celtic fiddle lessons in the, at the Cedia Centre. That was back in 2007. Anne worked hard that first year and then joined the Oakville Celtic Fiddle Orchestra. And it's a group of fiddlers that are very enthusiastic about Irish and Scottish music. Uh, and I'm from Cape Breton myself, and uh, so I, I direct them and conduct them and we learn music together. Personally, it's brought me a long way. I learned to play the piano as a child, was never really very good at it, but this clicks with me and uh, it's made a huge circle of friends and a huge number of places that I can go and do different things. There's spring concerts coming up on June 4th at Glen Abbey United Church. Once again, they're fundraising for Food for Kids. So, uh, these guys have prepared an awesome program. First of all, we worked on it all year. Uh, but also we have Highland Dancers uh, from the Cheryl Joyner Highland Dance School. And we also have Irish dancers from the Carol Goggin School of Irish Dance uh, joining us. So it's going to be, and also some of the members of, of the orchestra have their own groups and are going to present a couple of, uh, of numbers in smaller groups. So it's going to be a lot of variety, a lot of fun, a uh, good opportunity to raise money for a good cause. And Food for Kids Halton uh, actually puts the food in the kids' backpacks without anybody else knowing. And it's a, so it's a way that they can enjoy the benefit of that charity without being stigmatized. And I think it's brilliant. And I couldn't think of a better way to, to, uh, to help with fiddle music. The music, I dance. I dance to Scottish music and have done for many, many years. And it's just that kind of lilt and that it makes me, I can't sit still when I'm playing. <laughs> The show starts at 7.30 and you can get your tickets at the door. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley.